Welcome to myprojectpazar.com The project title is Inscription Free Framework of Privacy Preserving Image Recognition for Photo Based Information Services Nowadays mobile devices such as smartphones have been widely used all over the world In addition the performance of image recognition has drastically increased with deep learning technologies From these backgrounds, some photo-based information services provider in a client-server architecture are getting popular. Client users take a photo of a certain spot and send it to a server. While the server identifies the spot with an image recognizer and returns its related information to the users. However, this kind of client-server image recognition can cause a privacy issue because image recognition results are sometimes privacy sensitive. To, to uh, tackle the privacy issue, in this paper, we propose a framework of privacy preserving image recognition called ENP or NFIRE, in which the server cannot uniquely determine the recognition result, but client users can do so. An overview of in fire is as follows first client users extract a visible feature from the taken photo and transfer it so the server cannot uniquely determine the recognition result then the user send the transfer features to the server which returns the set candidates of the recognition result to the users finally the users compare the candidates to the original visual feature for obtaining the final result This is one page of our project, Encryption Free Framework of Privacy Preserving Image Revolution for Photo Based Information Service. I can start, okay, now I will go data owner login, okay, it was data owner, data owner entity, password, and also data owner on two page. I go to login, and to upload. So in the full description, I click report. That is the file content. It was the medical report of one person. Okay. Now I have to do search for giving what um, detail. Yeah. Now I will do next. I will just choose the animation and I will put this to the yeah, yeah. Okay, the image, yeah, it is the image. Okay, I give the image. So my image name and file format and file size, okay. Now I have to there set the take a secret key and I include the index. So it is a secret key and it is also the include tendency of our keyword. Okay, and then to define file name. So I put it into the image. Okay, now I go to upload. Yeah, file uploaded successfully. Okay, now I am going to close. I go to the close for the login. So password is cloud. Sorry, username is cloud and password is cloud one two three. And secret key I put cloud one two. So I go to login. So we upload. Yeah, last one that we put. We request this. So no request. Okay. And then next, there is a one. Sign a new one. So I go to sign up. So I give the name. Name is on. Name. So I give the username. Ray no Tom. Password is one two three one two three. One two three one two three. So the one not one not. Which name is that from? And the mobile number is. And then after the registration, we get the key. So I copy that. So login. So my username is Ray No Tom. So it's one two three one two three. Let's see the key. Okay. I go to login. 
Now I'm going to search. Uh, before I go, um, see, I go to search here yeah, and select it. Next, I go to file request. So, file request and to close server. So, request status in progress. Okay. Now, my way to do close process. I go to view request. Yeah. This is the right way to do Yeah. Now, I click boom. Right now, I have to next. How many uh, files are downloaded list? Okay. Now, I go to next. It was the cloud ID, so we request so ID verification, ID so grant permission, yeah, permission granted. So it happens to be QTD, verification and download page. Okay, now I need to the request stage step, permission granted, and verify. Next, first I have to decrypt the image, yeah, a file is created, and with the data, yeah, file was created, and I have to issue download. Very good. And the content. So this is the project. Thank you.